hey, I just watched a whole backlog of your videos from like, I don't know. I think the last, the first one I watched was July 27th. And wow, wow, I have a lot of spots on my face. I wonder why. Um, I'm certainly showering very frequently these days. It's hot, so every day I come home and take a shower. And some days I come home at lunch and take a shower. And most days I shower in the morning, too, because it's so freaking hot. Um, it's so hot that Ima, who tracks the weather of Seoul on her phone, which, by the way, Mom, that's adorable and really sweet, and I love you. Um... Yeah, she, she messaged me in screenshot and was like, are you okay? I was like, yes, I'm staying indoors with my best friend, the air conditioner. We're gonna party all day today and most of tomorrow. I'm very excited. Um, yeah, so I just watched a backlog of your videos. Um, well, I have now... Oh, no, I did meet Dan more than once. I met Dan when he brought that band to steampunk world's fair once um but i think today not to no that's not not today at all i'm in korea again at home uh i think the the visit with them i was certainly more more time spent with dan than i had spent with him before and even though i feel like i know them both well equally now i would say i prefer sarah on grounds that she brought me yarn she brought me two yarn um it takes very little to win my heart, and that did it. That was very effective. Yarn. I have yarn now. Uh, I have lots of yarn, and it wasn't really very expensive. Uh, and some of it was Japanese yarn that I can add to the Talit. Uh, it's very exciting. All very exciting. Uh, yeah, so I've been a bit delinquent about videos. I think I last made you one... Well, I definitely last made you one in Japan. Uh, and I am now not in Japan. Uh, let me think how that all went. When Tuesday, Tuesday I got back, uh, our flight was late. We were supposed to start boarding at six and we were just sort of sitting and at six and at 615 and at 630 and at 645, they were like, um, we will let you know when the plane gets here and, and then we'll clean it and you can get on. But so far, just sit. There's no plane. So we said there was no plan. Um, yeah, I don't... Immigration was super easy because I have an ARC, an alien card, um, alien registration card. And it was just like, sure, the line was long, but like, I didn't, turns out I didn't have to fill in the arrival card or the why do you want to come here card. I was a little worried because on the card, they're like, how long do you plan on staying? And I was like, um... I'll estimate till the end of the school year and tell you 210 days. Uh, but my visa in my passport says I have another approximately 50 days or 40 days. And I don't want you to misunderstand, but they, I handed over my passport and my ARC and my arrival card. And she was like, you have an alien card. You don't need this paper. It's nice. Very nice. Um, and that was it. Like they didn't do the fingerprinting and, photo taking that they do for everybody else they looked at me and they looked at my passport looked at my rc they were like very good that's it it's very easy it's nice um yeah so that was tuesday wednesday we had no kids in the morning but we had kids in the afternoon um thursday was a full day uh of my five kids just kids are absent left and right so of my usual five students um Two are still out. One in Canada or overcoming jet lag, I don't know which. And one with hand, foot, and mouth disease. He and his brother both have it. Um, so I only had three. And then Wednesday I went to game night, which was nice. Thursday I came home, I think. Yesterday, Friday. Today is Saturday, by the way. Yesterday, Friday, I picked up a couch surfer and went to Daiso and bought really an obscene amount of stuff but like it's all prizes for the kids they um my older students my elementary students can earn participation tickets if they both did all of their home if they did all of their homework if they brought all of their books and they're not a bump on a log during class then they can get a participation ticket which periodically can be redeemed for prizes 
So it incentivizes doing something useful with your life in my class. Um, and they've been saving them up, which was really ominous and meant that I kept having to make more tickets, which involved printing and cutting and laminating and cutting. I was just over it. And finally, I was like, you have to spend all your tickets this time. All of them. Absolutely every single last ticket. And we're starting over. Uh, and it turned out that I was right to be worried because they, they they purchased. And I set the prices high because I knew that they had a lot of tickets. Oh, man. Um, granted, it was for four classes, but I easily spent about 100 bucks on prizes. So, I mean, it's worth it considering that in return, they participate, are engaged in class, do their homework, bring their books, etc. So, and the kids who don't, have a very visible reminder that they don't and why they should. So, yeah. Um, I think anything else is exciting. Exciting is happening. Uh, there's something from your videos that I wanted to respond to, and I don't remember what. The oh, I wanted to ask if you had a cast list for two gentlemen of Verona because the lady in the pink skirt, um, the one. She was, like, flirting with the black guy through letters. She had him write a letter to himself, and it was very funny, uh, because he totally didn't get it until the other chick explained it to him. Um, anyway, she, I think, is Maria Constantinidis, who uh, went to temple with me. Maybe not, but her voice sounded very similar. Um, the visuals were not great. Oh, what I wanted to laugh about was the internet thing. Um, I'm starting to think... When you said that a video of a minute uploaded in, like, 13 seconds, I was like, yeah, isn't that, isn't that normal? I guess I, I didn't really try and upload a whole lot of videos while back in Philly. Um, but, yeah, that's, that's normal in Korea. Whether I'm at home with my home Wi-Fi, which is free, included with my $50 apartment maintenance fee, um, or whether I'm standing at the train station using the public Wi-Fi, like, that's what Korea has. Like, everything. It's great. Uh, Japan, on the other hand, Tokyo was shit. It was just... Even when I was at my host's home, when I was at Yoko's place, logged into her Wi-Fi, first of all, it would kick me off every so often. Like, it just stopped existing. It just went out every so often. And it was so freaking slow. Uh, and I think that might be what yours is like at home, and I don't know how you stand it. It was not... I mean, I remember having days like that, but it's not since I got to Korea. Um... Not only do I have 5G Wi-Fi in my apartment, but so does everybody else in the complex, in our building, and all of our passwords are structured the same way. So, like, my apartment is 301, and our building is the Century building, so my password is Century 301, and so, like, they're all the same, which means I can have anyone's Wi-Fi if mine is being obnoxious. It's really great. Um, anything else? Today, I plan on, since you need this information, waxing my legs and maybe knitting, catching up on links that I had saved to read later on the internet, which will take a while. And then tomorrow afternoon, I'm having dinner in Hongdae on the other end of the city with some gaming groups. Should be nice. Um, I think that's it. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'm going to have to remember to make my videos as frequently now because uh, I don't know if I told you Ryan had two bikes. Well, now I have one of those bikes and I'm biking to and from work because it minimizes the amount of time I'm out in the heat. It's great. It's like a minute to work when I'm on a bike, maybe two. Um, but it means that I can't make you a video while walking. So I have to remember to do that. This video is now really long, so I'm going to stop by.